How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Videos. Here today to show you how to reset your Kindle back to factory settings. Okay. Um, first thing we want to do is we want to find the uh, quick settings option up here at the top. It's a little wheel, a little white wheel. We want to go ahead and tap on that. And our little quick settings menu comes up. Click on the button all the way to the right that says more. And now it's going to take us to our actual settings. Get a little closer here. And so what we're going to do is we want to come down to where it says device. Tap on device. Okay. And uh, what we want to do is all the way at the bottom right here. You guys can see that it says reset to factory default. So we want to go ahead and tap on that. And then it says you're about to reset your Kindle to default settings, which will remove all your personal information and your account. Do you wish to continue? Click on erase everything. And now we are getting a full reset. It's erasing all the memory and it's going to start it back over. Let's just watch it real quick. It's going to shut it down. Dum, 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 dum. This is a great thing to do in case uh, maybe you bought a Kindle that was used or maybe someone bought it, gave it to you, but their information is still on it. You can go ahead and reset it, set it back up again so it has all your information. And here we are. And this is the end. And now you know you fully reset because it takes you back to this, which is uh, the first screen you see when you turn the Kindle on. And now it's asking like to set the networks and everything. So this is how we know. Oh, turn it off. This is how we know our Kindle is fully reset. Now it's asking the Kindle button at the bottom is not a good spot. Anyway, it's asking now to set up a wireless network. So we're fully reset back to factory defaults. And then you can go ahead and um, put in your Amazon account and basically get um, started putting your information back in it or starting for the first time. So hope that was helpful and uh, have a good one.